This little straight stretch right here, we can we can bring back some time here. This can't hit nothing. In pursuit of a hit and run driver. And I, hit that. A I hit a cop like an idiot. I hit a cop like a moron. Oh my goodness. Enter body shot. Good evening. Put me in here, baby. This thing has seen better days. How can I help you? I need to repair the $250? God! Repair it. Oh my god. I'm just fucking my car up, bro. I'm just messing this thing up. Just got it fixed. Messing it up. I hate myself right now. I'm doing it dope. For the tubes. Hey, you <laughs> What's up, it's Johnny, and welcome back to uh, Mafia 2 Definitive Edition, where we just left off. We uh, just started Chapter 3, where we woke up, obviously, just off of the couch. Now we got a phone call, uh, which is right here. Answer the phone. Joe's pleasure, pal. It's Vito speaking. Vito, why didn't you come home last night? I was worried sick. Mama? I didn't know you had Joe's number. And whose phone is this? So have you spoken to Mr. Papalardo? Find yourself a job? Yeah, he told me to come by and see him today. Hopefully he's got some work for me. Okay, Vito. Seems super Good luck, sus. Mio All right, that bye, she's Mama. got, uh... Vito's, not Vito's number. Uh, what is his, what's his face's? Number. And... Just weird. Okay, go to the Southport docks and see... Whatever. Let's go ahead and grab this leather jacket. Open this door up. We should have full health, so we should be good. We don't need to go and eat the food or anything. We did that last episode. And... Yes, it's here. Take this. Open the door. We actually went the wrong way. We should have went the other way and got our car. Let's go ahead and get our car real quick. Should be right here. Yes. Bada bing, open the garage. We have taxes. When did we get these? What? Oh, give, give me this thing. Are you joking? Let's go, baby. Oh, this thing is not good. I'd handle, I can tell you that. Alright, we gotta go take it, right? Oh, my fault. Oh, it's a by hit run driver. Oh, oh, things are happening so bad. Copy that. Oh, dumb. Oh, dumb. Just real dumb. In pursuit of a speeding vehicle. Yo, this thing's handsome. Copy that. It's butt cheeks. It's straight butt cheeks. Everything about it, butt cheeks. Died. That's our first, that's our first death. That's how we're starting this episode. We're dying out here. All right, we're gonna try that one more again, okay? We, we literally just, that did not go well that last time. So let's, uh, let's take it easy on the whole, oh, that guy's gonna stop. So let's go ahead and go ahead and go down this way. But we, we need this thing fixed, because this thing is not looking too great. Okay, are we gonna go again? This thing is actually my hard, uh, the handle. That last one though, let me tell you something. Not easy. I guess that's why they call it the drifter for a reason. Okay, we are getting close. It's right. This. Actually, should we go ahead and nah, we're good. The repair right there, because there's a repair shop, but I think we'll be okay. Ain't no thing but a dude, you not. Please, thank you. I mean, I guess it's definitely, it would have been his right away, but that's all right. Okay. I also want to apologize. I I have a video ready to rock for... Uh, we went the wrong freaking way. My fault. <laughs> <laughs> I am awful. Okay, anyway, like I was saying, I had a video ready. Uh, it should have had you guys, I should have had it to you guys yesterday, but um, 
I guess technically what you guys are watching this, it's already out. But it took it's it's taken like nine, ten hours just to upload. Um, that's how bad my internet is. That's why it's so hard for me to get content. Like it can be done, the content can be ready to rock and like ready ready for me to upload, but I can't get it to you guys in a fat in a timely manner unless I, you know, bolt record. And that's kinda what I'm hoping to do with this game. So again, my apologies. I'm hoping I can get a double upload to you guys as well since I'm uh, recording this in advance. But uh, we will see here. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna hit that wall. If we can do this here. Hey, you need to relax, dude. I got it's my fault, but you know. All right, let's rock in here, here, and we are here. Oh my God, I remember this place. I actually remember the ending of this game. That's crazy. Okay. Uh. Uh, dude, come on now. Stop smacking your lips. Nasty. Oh, open the door. It's windy. What do you want? Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a Mr. Papalotto. Oh, yeah? Why? My name is Vito Scaletta. My old man used to work for him, and I'm looking for a job, so I came here. Well, you're in the right spot, sonny boy. Federico Papayato at your service. You can call me Derek. I think I remember your dad. Good guy, but drank like a fish. What's he up to these days? He's dead. Oh, well, you all gotta go sometime. Right, Steve? Sure, Derek. So you need a job, huh? Well, you're in luck. We just got a new shipment to unload. Steve will show you around. Now, Scram, my steak's getting cold. Damn, what a jerk. Uh, follow me. Y'all seem like you guys hate you guys' lives. <laughs> Alright, so we got a new job. We gotta follow Steve down this staircase. Come on, dude, we get it. And I can't really, can't really yell at the game. This is like an extremely old game. What, 10 years? Though. So. Alright, um, well, yeah, we're here. Let's, uh, we, let's go. Today Load we'll this pile of crates onto that truck. When you're done, you get ten bucks. If something gets lost or broken, you get nothing. Start now and don't take all day. What? Load the crates on the truck. Fifth crate. Okay. Ten dollars. Bruh. This is gonna take me ages. This is gonna take me ages. You're out of your mind if you think I'm doing this all day. I can't even run. Load the crate. Oof. Break it, why don't you? Does the open doors open leave when you have leave when you've had enough? Jeez, all this for ten lousy bucks? You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna do one more, I'm gonna leave. I'm out of here with this. Okay? It's taking me way too long, man. Okay? Way too long. Who wants to do this for ten dollars? I'm with him. Okay, who wants to do this? Ten dollars an hour, maybe. Even then, it's like, eh, you know, I don't know about my time about that one. Here's the thing about life, right? You only get so much time before you before you die. And I don't feel like taking my life, putting it in someone else's hand to tell me that I'm worth so much money. Hey, mm -hmm. you done? Yeah, I'm done. And you can keep the ten bucks. When I said I needed a job, I didn't mean slave labor. Whatever. Get the fuck out of here, then. Don't show your face around here again. Yeah, don't worry. I can make a hundred times more working for Barbaro Incorporated. Wait, you said Barbaro? Joe Barbaro? Yeah, so what? Shit, nobody who works with Joe would carry crates for ten bucks. What the hell are you doing? Come with me. I'm talking about, man. Show me the real work. Show me the freaking the real... Real work, okay? I want to I wanna hitman somebody. Okay? Throw him in a dumpster somewhere. 
know what I'm saying? Give me that thousand dollars to freaking shoot someone in the head. I already killed two or three people running what for a car. now? Well, this one don't like manual labor. What the fuck? Said he works with Joe Barbaro. Bullshit. Who want to load crates if he works with Joe? You'll have to explain this one to me, sonny boy. What's your story? Uh, well, my mother wanted me to come talk to you about an honest job, but I need some real money, so this ain't gonna cut it. <laughs> Them women, they're all the same. Right, Steve? Sure, He's just Derek. a yes, man. She doesn't want you hanging around with Joe, right? <laughs> my mother was the same way. Look what become of me. Union boss, I got the whole fucking waterfront under my thumb. So how's Joe? Pretty good, I guess. How'd you meet up with him? Oh, we go way back to the old neighborhood. I just come back from overseas and he's putting me up until I can get back on my feet. Listen, uh, you gotta understand, a person in my position has gotta be careful. Right. Certainly. So you won't mind if I give Joe a call, right? Nah, nope. go ahead. Now, where'd I put his number? Hey, here it is. So if we're lying, he's gonna shoot us. But we ain't lying, baby. We ain't lying. He might not be home. That wouldn't be good. Hi, hey, Joe. Hey, this is Derek. Listen, I got this guy here. Uh, what'd you say your name was? Vito. Vito. He's looking for a job. He says he's a friend of yours. A good friend. I just wanted to check with you first. Uh-huh. Sure. War hero and all that shit. All right, all right. Thanks, then. I'll talk to you later. Sorry, pal. I had to check you out. Joe says you just come back from Italy. You must be able to handle yourself. You want to make a little more money? I got just the thing. The guys here at the port are supposed to pay a monthly fee to the barber, but half of them never cough it up. I need someone to give them a little nudge. Ten bucks a man. What if they don't need a haircut? Well, then you'll have to convince them otherwise. I see. What if somebody makes a fuss? Then you kick the shit out of them. <laughs> well, let's say you teach them a lesson that doesn't require that they miss work. You got it? Which is why Steve ain't doing the job. Right, Steve? Right, boss. Collect at least 150 bucks, I give you 50. Just for walking around, taking it in the Sierra, meeting new people. Easy fucking money, eh? Huh? What do you say? Yeah, hey, Done it's deal. better than lugging crates around. All right, then. All right, Get so going. Coming off this door. And I gotta freaking go out. Oh my god, I go all the way down here. Collect Derek's fees from the dock workers. So it was one of. The... I go over here and get this way. Is... No, wait, what? Is one of these over here one of the people I gotta talk to? Why is he red? <clears throat> I'm here to collect the fee for the barber. I was just coming to pay. Actually, he's pretty good barber. Thanks. Appreciate your cooperation. Boom. Bada bing. Hey, pal. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. Again? I don't even go to the damn barber. Here, you give it to the Robin son of a bitch. Next time, try to pay on time, okay? Thanks. <laughs> oh, man. What? We already helped this guy? No, I didn't. Hey. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. You've got the wrong guy, pal. My wife cuts my hair. Yeah, that's sweet. But while you work here, you get a haircut when Derek says. Okay. Okay, okay, enough already. Here's your fucking money. Yeah, glad you decided to reconsider. Bada bang. Thank you. Oh, this guy. That's why he's red. Red arrow. Ooh, I'm so scared. Hey, pal. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. Look, asshole, I'm not in the mood. Why don't you get out of my face before you get hurt? Ah, no can do, pal. Derek wants his money. Derek can kiss my ass. What's that fat fuck gonna do? Have me killed? Hey, you said it, not me. Why don't you give it a try then, asshole? Kill him! I gotta beat this ass! Kill him when you run! 
Come on, come on. Oh, okay. Are you gonna play? Are you gonna play? That's what I'm talking about. Get up. Get up. Yep. Get back up. I ain't done with you. Watch this. Dodge. Hit with that one, two, and then the three zones. Mayweather's. Here we go. Oh. Yep. Get back up, big boy. Get back up. Oh, you stumbling now. Oh, you want to make me stumble. Okay, big boy. Oh my god, I get down of the freaking dodge and he comes at me so fast. Yep. Ain't doing it. Get back up. Boom. Oof. Yikes. I need all you efforts to pay up. Okay. Anybody else got a fucking problem with paying for the fucking barber? <laughs> you took that big guy down, dude. Take the cash back to Derek. Can I get his cash? Oh, I beat him up, huh? He's done. All right, well. Oh, they got like 30 bucks. I didn't get that much. What you? You can give me some real cash? I got his money already. Okay. What this guy? I got his money already. Oh, so they already paid me. Got it. After I beat him, I guess they all gave me the money. I didn't get a notification saying they gave me all the money, so. Here you go. Here's the money, boss man. Good job. Here's your share. I watched you take care of Bill. You were good. Steve damn near got his ass kicked when he tried that. Right, Steve? Yeah, right, Derek. Here's a bonus for sorting him out. Thanks. The guy's been a real fucking pain. Now get out of here, kid. I gotta be getting back to business. And say hello to your mother for me. Tell her you got yourself a job as my new assistant. Yeah, will do. I'll see you later. Vito, That's freaking gold. I almost forgot. Joe bucks. called. He wants you should meet him at Freddy. Freddy's? Freddy's Freddy's in Little Il Italy. Little Italy. God, I can't words. <clears throat> now, I think eventually, when we get enough money and stuff, we can get, like, new guns and, uh, uh, new cars. Okay. On here. See if we can get there pretty... Oh, hello. I'll hit that thing. See if we can just kind of get there, like, in a, in a jiff, shall we? No peanut butter. So far, so good with the cops. We gotta take a right right here. This car is actually decent. Like, it goes pretty quick and it handles very well. Like, very, very well. I'm hoping we can get something kind of like that in the future. Or kind of like this in the future. Where we can actually, like, get a decent car that handles well. Excuse me, sir. Coming in strong. Whoop! I thought I'd leave that sign, to be honest. Ah! Ah! Oh my god. Little Italy. We're finally here. Should we go up here to the left, maybe? Okay. Right up here to the right. Let's go. Park this bad boy right here. Get out. Man, that was freaking... Look at that park job! We kind of nailed that, to be honest. Alright, where are we gonna go? Looks like... Yeah, right here. This is Freddy's? Are you Freddy? Browse what would you like? Coffee Freddy's. All of... Okay. 45 cents for a beer. 65 cents for a whiskey. I'm not a huge drinker, but I feel like that's very cheap. I also don't feel like... We have like a $400 in cash on us. I don't feel like it's a good idea to care that much. Especially what we're... Hey. Where the hell you been? I came right over as soon as you called. What's going on? You remember the wise guys we used to see when we was kids? Yeah, why? The guy we're meeting here is one of them. His name's Henry Tomasino. I think he's got something big for us. Yeah, no shit. Yeah. We're done with the small-time jobs. It's time to make some real shuttle. Here, he's coming. Don't say nothing stupid. 
Hey, Henry, how are you? Hey, Joe. This the guy? Yeah, this is Vito, an old friend of mine. Good to meet you, Henry. You vouch for him? Absolutely, Henry. Trust him with my life. Okay, listen. I got a job for you. The money's good. I need gas I'm stamps. Listening. They're worth the fortune now because of the gas shortage. Where can we get them? In the Office of Price Administration. Uh, that's a federal government agency. Isn't that a little risky? What? Too much for you? No, no, no. Just trying to think of how we can pull it off. Ah, it can't be that hard. The stamps are kept in the safe at night, but the keys are probably around here somewhere. You got somebody inside? Yeah, one of our guys. His sister works there. Can she help us out? Ask her yourself. Her name's Maria Agnello. Here's the address. Tell her I say it. All right, what about the safe? What if the keys aren't there? That's your problem. But what's the job pay? I'll give you 600 bucks for 10,000 gallons worth of stamps. Okay, we're in. No, no, I need Vito to do this alone. I got another job for you, Joe. So? What do you say, Vito? Yeah, sure. Hey, and don't forget to take a piece with you. You never know what's gonna happen. Better to be safe than sorry. I got beef. Wait, wait, wait. This isn't some liquor store stick-up. I want this to be a clean job. If you kill anybody, your cut drops to a third. Got got it? Yeah, I got it. No problem. Okay, when you're done, you come back in, we'll settle up. All right, I'll see Good you. luck, Vito. All right, so we gotta go uh, rob some gas stamps. We can't kill nobody. If we kill somebody, we're definitely gonna have to... Uh, oh, we're definitely gonna have our, our cut pay. Our pay cut. Words, man, what am I talking about? All right, here you go. I go this way? Can. All right, so we definitely don't want to kill nobody because we need it. We need that six hundred dollars. We need to try to like make as much money as we can because we never know when we're gonna need it. Maybe we'll get like a nice gun or some new suits or a new car, something like that. And I feel like we could really, really use that, especially in the later game. Hey, we're back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check the door signs to find Maria's apartment. Uh, Maria Agnello. Agnello. There we go. Yeah, can I help you? Yeah, hello, ma'am. Uh, Henry Tomasino sent me. He said you might be able to help me with a little problem down at the Office of Price Administration. Yeah, I heard about that. What do you need from me? Uh, I need to get in there tonight. All right, tell you what. My sister's in the hospital right now. If you give me a lift over there, I'll tell you everything you need to know. It's right across the street from the OPA, so it ain't like you're gonna be going out of your way. Sure, no problem. Boom, let's get it. Go, baby. Why does it, why does it give me the option to kick, or, yeah, to kick open the door? I think it's a little excessive. Just open the door like a normal person. Get in. Okay, uh, what? Is she gonna get in or? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, wait for her to get in. I was like, uh, maybe they just didn't put her person in the car. You know what I'm saying? Like, didn't put her character in. Okay, let's in. go and take it you know, easy behind, behind the wheel, all right? I see the way it. you kids drive these days. Press the all right, kid. To toggle safe driving. The place is locked up pretty tight at night, so you gotta get into the back. They keep the back door open oh, at night. Okay, so no, it limits you. but the basement window like usually that. is, so that's how you I'm can get in. You're looking for the safe, right? Yeah, how'd you know? Lucky guess. It's on the top floor. So's the director's office. That's where the keys are. Okay. So I go in through a window around the back, then head upstairs to the director's office, right? Right. And be careful. There's guards in there at night. Don't let them see you. All right. And this is gonna be a tough one. I'm not very good at stealth games. So we're definitely gonna be probably killing somebody. I don't want to, but I'm just not confident in my ability to stay very, very sneaky toward doing this entire thing. All right, kid. Drop me at the hospital right here. The office is across the street. Okay, thanks for the ride, kid. Thanks, Maria. I'll see you. My car looks like crap. All right. Get inside the office of price administration. Okay. Think we can handle that. Think we can handle that. Alright, so it looks like let's park our car. 
here. Let's get out. And the way to go this way, it looks like. Oops. Okay, so it looks like there's going to be a window that right around in this area. We, uh... Okay, I was going to see if we could save it, but we can't. No saves coming in this game, apparently. I don't see a window. I'm over the obstacle. Okay. You would think they would put... What? What kind of fence is that? <clears throat> Be very, very quiet. They hid that there's guards around. Okay. Where's the stairs at? Okay. Get the key from the director's office. I'll believe that when I see it. That pipe down when I finish my work. Alright. I'm gonna go make the round. Good riddance. Get behind him and take him out. Alright, here we go. Okay, there's one here. Okay, so there's one. It's right here. Okay. We can drag the body. Okay. Grab it. Did I not drag the body? Hello? No. Drag the body. Thank you. Drag it, drag it, drag it. We're good. I just don't want them to come down and then have them see that body. So we're going to grab him, put him over here. Find this door. Okay. I did think I kind of wanted to be a hitman. And I guess this kind of is what we're doing. So. Hey. Okay. The guy to my left up here. Okay. Oh my god. It's really gonna work. Are you effing joking? That worked? No way! Pick up revolver. Got a new gun. Alright, so is there any more? Or is there just three guards? You would think to be more of the people than that. Okay. This is the director's office. This Open is it. where the key should be. Got it? Take the key? Alright, here's the key. Now I gotta get to the safe. All right? Find the safe and steal the stamps. Do that. I cannot believe that freaking work, dude. Right here, right here, right here. Good. Open the door. Press. Move the pen. Oh my god. Red button right there. I don't know how I feel about that. Is that gonna, like, make a freaking siren or. I have no idea. Thinking at all, to be honest. Oh my god. This is the Empire Bay Police Department. We have you surrounded. Can we go up this way? Come out with your hands up. If you do not surrender immediately, we will open fire. Okay, how do I get out? Climb over. That's what I was supposed to do. Man! Alright. <laughs> Bada bing. Probably gonna die. Go, 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 go. Climb it! Oh my god, I could have been out there way faster. I didn't even see. Can you can you do it any slower? Turn to Freddy's bar. Alright. There's cops to my right. Go. In the car. Oh, 
Oh, don't make a freaking scene on the way out. Here we go. Turn around. We're good. So far, so good. So far, so good. All right. I think, we, I think we're good. Oh, yeah, those cops, like, now I'm not helping them. They got that shit under control. I did kill them. Well, how'd you make out? Uh, things got out of hand. There's nothing I could do about it. We had an agreement. Remember? You only get a third of the money if there's any shooting. Uh, let's see what we got here. I didn't... Yeah, they, they shot. Ah, shit. I didn't shit. shoot nobody, though. That's why I thought something I wasn't clear. You bet your ass there's something wrong. These stamps you took have an expiration date. And that date is tomorrow. So, uh, what exactly does that mean? It means they're gonna be fucking worthless. But wait. If you can get them to the gas station attendance by midnight, they'll be able to stamp them and redeem them. You better bring them to every gas station in town. They gotta get there by midnight or we're screwed. If you don't sell them in time, you get nothing. Wait a minute, that wasn't our deal. You didn't say anything about any expiration dates. Well, shit happens, doesn't it? Look, you pull this off, I won't forget it, trust me. Now get going. The faster you unload them, the more money you get. Okay. <clears throat> Man, I'm kind of mad though because I mean, guess I mean they they shot, so that's really annoying. Can't run until we get out of here. Okay, take care. All right, let's go. Uh, go 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 go. Where? What's the map? Okay, we got one right here. Place waypoint. The waypoint is displayed on the radar. Got it. All right, so we got to get there before I fall. Park by the cashier and press X. All right, so we're actually there. I got these extra gas stamps. You want them? They're yours. Cheap. Yeah. All right. I'm good with that. All right, Dude, here I'm you only, go. I'm not gonna be able to make you keep all your these. mouth shut about this, all right? Sure thing, buddy. It'll be our secret. It go! better be. I got that kind of time. Uh, there, dude. There's gas stations everywhere. Let's hit this one over here. Got a quarter of the freaking time out of that. We're just for talking that one dude. All right, here we go. See if we can make this. That. God dang, dude. <laughs> this snow, man, it's crazy. <laughs> I guess I am kind of going fast, but jeez. Hey, Go. uh, interested in buying some gas stamps? Sure. Just keep this between you and me, all right? No problem. Just make sure you do the same. Sure. Sounds good to me. Hey. Okay. Uh, what should we, we got one down here? Uh, yeah. Hey. Okay. Gotta go. Come on. Pass the car. Go this way. Hit this right. Turn, please. Man, F that hole. Came out of nowhere. Get off me. Yep. I nailed that. I'm gonna need you to get out of that. That thing messed me up. Oh my jeez. Okay. I'm so glad they don't care about, uh, like, not going through red lights and stuff. Like, or going through red lights, rather. Because. I've been doing that the entire game right next to cops. And they're just, they don't care. They just kind of look the other way. Hey, this way. This way. Okay, we're not even halfway, so we should be able to. There's still there's so so many freaking gas stations. And one, two, three, we have four. No, five. And I'm an idiot. And I actually passed one up. I was counting like an idiot. Here we go. This way. Kind of roll in here. Hit hey, that. uh, I got some ex Okay, we'll hit this one up. Extra gas stamps. You interested? Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm interested. All right, here you go. Fork over the dough. 
Sure. Sure. Here's your money. Thanks, pal. Now forget you saw me. No, forget about me. Bada bing. Yeah. So God, we, we might be able to do it, but the, the, the problem here is we're going to hit the ones all on this one side. Then we're going to have to go all the way across, across the freaking the state or whatever just to get to the other side. So we're going to lose hella time on that. Okay. This. Come on, give me, a, give me a straight stretch. Let me make some time back. Okay. There go. Hi, bad. Hey, uh, interested in buying some gas stamps? Sure. Just keep this between you and me, all right? No problem. Just make sure you do the same. Sure. Sounds good to me. First hit, perfect. Four out of the six. Ah, wrong button. Uh, let's see, we could probably hit this one. And then we'll go across the, the, the bridge and then hit that one on the other side. And that should be six. And we haven't hit the, the halfway mark. So as long as we can hit this in a fashion, fashionly good time. No, can you not, please? Thank you. Doing something. I really need to re redo my car. But once we get this money... <coughs> you were a halfway at midnight. Okay, I got it. Come on, baby. Come on. This little straight stretch right here, we can we can bring back some time here. Just can't hit nothing. In pursuit of a hit and run driver. And Copy I hit that. A I hit a cop like an idiot. I hit a cop like a moron. I'm an oh my god, I cannot believe I just did that. Hey, Mom. uh, you in the market for some surplus gas stamps? Sure. Where'd you get them? Uh, and second thought, I don't even want to know. Smart man. All right, now fork over the dough. Yeah, all right. All right. Just hope I don't get in trouble for this. Don't worry about it. Just keep your mouth shut. Come on, we got time. Oh my gosh. Okay, we can probably make this. I, I doubt it. There's no way. We got to go, though. It's a problem. That took so much time trying to get that ball off me. All right. This left. Right now, we got a quarter of the time. We got to make it all the way across town over a bridge and then go in deeper before we even get there. Okay. Let's go. We ain't gonna do it, make it, dude. There's no way. No way, Jose. If we can hit this bridge, like, relatively soon, I uh, maybe, but I'm an idiot to hit that car, so. I, the thing about this game is, it's so janky. If you move over to left or right, your car doesn't go left or right. It's like, it's not like GTA, which makes sense, because it's an older game. So, that's why I hit that car, because I went right. Because I'm used to, like, swooping in out of cars on GTA, not this game. Like, look, I'm hitting, I'm hitting the right stick, bro. I'm, Right now, or left stick rather, to move. Right now I'm hitting it, and it doesn't move. It barely moves. There goes my hood. Oh, we got plenty of time. Hey, Let's go, uh, baby. I got some extra gas stamps. You interested? Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm interested. All right, here you go. Fork over the dough. Sure, sure. Here's your money. Thanks, pal. Now forget you saw me. All right, that's the last of them. Can I? Can I? At least I got some cash. I should head back. I want to buy gas. Buy gas. Good evening, sir. Full tank, please. Be done in a jiffy. Let's go, baby. I'd like that. Such a cool little cool little thing in the car. 
Right, I'm my car is messed up. What I really want to do is that, you know, like. Do I gotta you get are? this car fixed? Thank you. This See thing's ya. seen better days for sure. Dollar fifty-eight for a full tank of gas. That's nuts. All right, can we? Is there a place to go to fix my car? Uh, we'll probably hit up this one, this body shop. Just once we hit up here, we can get pretty much a straight shot all the way across. Right. Honestly, this this game had some really good mechanics, like getting gas and stuff. I, I like that. I don't know why, but games where you have to eat and stuff, I love it. I think it's such a great idea. A lot of people don't like it, like you have to eat, drink, and like put gas in your car and stuff. I to be honest, hate that, but I love it. Absolutely adore it. South Port is a cop right here, so I don't want to hit that guy. Like I did that other guy. So I hit that dude freaking head on, bro. Trying to get there. Trying to get there in time. Okay, hit that left. Thank you. I'm trying to like race there, but I don't need to race there. I just need to get there. This right there is pretty much. I hit this little roundabout here, and then I just go straight all the way there. Now, last episode, I was saying that this thing needs to be like a GTA. It really kind of already is. But I'm seeing like. Oh, I squeezed by that guy. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I was saying like. If they could just add more mechanics, like side quests, and like more characters, and like more customization, and make it like an RPG kind of thing. Like they made like a, a Mafia 4, but like an RPG, kind of like they did with like Cyberpunk, something like that. Um, that would be amazing. I'm gonna squeeze past these guys. A car, a cop car right here. My tire just went out. Oh my god. Right. Been getting pretty close. Oh my goodness. Enter body shot. Good evening. Put me in here, baby. This thing has seen better days. How can I help you? I need to repair the $250? God. Repair it. God, dude, I have nothing right now. Thanks a lot. That took some change out of us, bro. Hopefully we get paid from a pretty good or a pretty good amount from this guy. Because if not, we didn't we didn't really make anything. Just trying to get there alone cost us $250. 265? No wait. What was it? 248? I don't talk about it. You guys didn't see that. Seriously, you guys did not see that. Just fucking my car up, bro. I'm just messing this thing up. Just got it fixed. Messing it up. I hate myself right now. I'm doing it though. For the tubes. Hey, you <laughs> <laughs> my fault, my fault. Are you joking? Mad, he was big mad, bro. Jeez, I've had a hell of a freaking day, man. Hell of a freaking day. Stole things, got shot at, about killed myself in a freaking car accident, and I about got my ass beat. You joking? Uh, but doesn't that guy money? He should have gave me two hundred dollars. Did he give me two hundred dollars? I wasn't paying attention. Look at this. Didn't know Joe could even write. We got another job. Something really big. Stop by Freddy's tonight. Bring a piece and some lock picks. All right, guys. We're gonna be calling it right here. This is episode number two of Mafia Two Definitive Edition. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, share your friends. And as always, guys, I'm Mr. Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode of Mafia. And I'm hoping I can get a uh, Modern Warfare Two as well. I do want to finish that game up. So yeah, see you guys soon.